hello, I'm Martin Fenska and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Civilization 5 as the Shoshona. So last time we finally managed to take Amsterdam. Uh, well, initially the plan was to take more than just uh, Amsterdam. I really wanted Breda, but it's not gonna happen now when William has nukes and uses them pretty freely. I think we'll just end this and hope that we won't have to fight them again. Again, because even though he's down to four cities, actually five cities, and doesn't have his capital, he's still pretty strong. And uh, well, the like the location is annoying here in the middle, Amsterdam on the coast. He has still some ships. He'll be able to rebuild. It would be annoying fighting him again if he, for some reason, decided to declare. Which is definitely possible because now with all of the penalties that we have to like relations uh he might be forced to declare war just because he hates us too much but well we'll see about that we'll just end the war uh right after that we declare on colombo again because i really want to get it 11 aluminum is quite a lot and potentially it uh, gives us access to this coal if we decide to invest the general into that but i i think i'm actually steal the uranium rather than the coal if we get another general but we'll see about that mm. so let's start with the peace treaty initially i wanted to just figure it out off camera so we don't have to waste time on that but holy crap are the peace treaty bugged so um initially what i wanted i wanted to check if he would accept uh giving me a city as a part of the peace treaty i tried all cities he won't accept okay fine there were there are some changes to peace treaties and how the ais value different different items they are not willing to give up cities i can live with that so instead i wanted to get some luxuries we can even take like citrus why not and i wanted gold as much gold as possible but well then we have this annoying bullshit that i can't ask for more than 9999 and i'm pretty sure this is new because there isn't even like a hard cap on the amount on the number of digits that you can type in or that can fit in because if i ask for his offer there can be five digits digits in there and i'm 99 percent certain that in the past i managed to negotiate peace three days where i got more than ten thousand, and i was able to type it in this has been changed recently i i'm like as i said 99 percent certain of that and on top of that he's offering salary but if i ask uh, if i say accept to his proposal he refuses so someone fucked up the ai logic for uh peace treaties big time uh well this is annoying because for the late game wars when you have let's say two massive empires left in the game and you need multiple wars to uh like win the game the crucial thing is to be able to get advantageous peace treaty so that with peace treaty you take away more and more like let's say like resources and i don't know how to say it, like economy away from 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 your enemy and if i if you can't negotiate proper peace treaties that uh, what the fuck so yeah but well what i can do here it seems that the city is the problem so when i get rid of that i i, I now can accept um for some reason it now shows the value i don't know why here we have impossible it's just bug as hell so if i ask for something more i would like to ask for more money but yeah look at that it just Oh, this is such a bullshit. And now it's impossible. Why is it... Uh, someone kill me. Okay, once again. There. 
That's that. Glass, citrus. We refuse the city. I'll take the coal because he's offering it, so why not? I would much rather take gold instead, but well, I guess I have to take whatever the ge game gives me. This is really pissing me off. Um, propose. Yeah, we accept it. Can we get like an embassy? We can. For I guess one gold per turn on top of that. So let's accept that before he changes his mind next turn. And he will change his mind. Uh, world map is impossible. I don't want to sell him anything. Yeah, I guess that's it. Okay. Well, the important thing is, we have his capital, we now have 15 turns to fortify it, and also... I'm actually gonna declare next turn, I think. Um... I'm pretty sure Vienna is gonna get nuked again. I'll just lock some tiles. What do we want here? Oh, definitely a castle. Okay. Now, we still have the border to debuff. How are we gonna do this? You'll move back. How much damage do we need? <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, I'll take that. Then, one. Two. I'm gonna send some destroyers north. Okay, then the Admiral will have to help here. Let's. I think I'm actually gonna stay right here. You can have some real long turns for like next three or four turns, I think, until I reorganize everything. It is gonna take a while. Okay, on this side, now we have um, a lot of money, so let's use all of it. Um, you are gonna move forward. We can move back. Fortunately, if I want to want to do attack, I'm gonna be able to upgrade. So instead, one, two, three. All of this is done. I wouldn't be able to do any damage this turn, but it's fine. Next turn we'll be much stronger. Okay, that's that. Just actually, well, we don't have a railroad here. Let's build that. Fortify, fortify. We could probably attack with this gunship. It's not a horrible damage. It's not great either. I can step back. He'll attack again. Move back. That's fine. Fortify here. Uh, you stay in the city. Now we... Ha Do we have the railroad here? Yes. Keep fixing. And you can keep building the village. Yeah, that's fine. You guys will sit 
where you are. Please zoom in. Is there? There is a road here. I think we don't need it, so let's just get rid of it. We can't upgrade tanks and we won't be able to force wait modern arm I thought modern armor required um, aluminum for some reason, so we will be able to get that. Um I want to make sure that these two roads are blocked. Just in case there is a surprise attack. Then we want to have something ranged in the city. How far can the machine gun move? Far enough. Upgrade. Can we buy a bazooka? Can't upgrade here. Damn, this is a mess. So we definitely want the gunships on this side. First, we want to get rid of Greece and Morocco. So the siege gun or siege weapons, whatever, uh, will be heading this way. Uh, you need repairs, but upgrade first. We can send the tank. South as well. Well, that was fast. Um, how much money do we still have? Twenty-three thousand. I need some ranch units on the coast because there are quite a few ships. Don't see anything, unfortunately. So I'll probably have to wait for the for the artillery to arrive. What else? Now the zeppelin. Can move this way. This should be safe. We have 33 hit points. We're gonna heal again. There is no way there is enough damage hiding to kill that mechanized infantry. Uh, let's upgrade this guy. This one. This one. Probably should have moved them first because I'm pretty sure that at least this one is standing on uh, uh, the nuclear fallout. Now we have 20,000 and advanced ballistics in two turns. So there are some pretty important, uh, pretty important upgrades. So let's save for that. Good. I declare I'm gonna get kicked out of the territory, right? No, I'm not. Now we can be a bit more aggressive when we know that 
Mm, we won't get killed by these units. Sure. Don't see the helicopter gunships. There. Okay, let me check once again for upgrades. If there's something important enough. All of this is up to date. Yeah, I think it looks good. Next. Are we done? No, we are not. Next. Now, I think we should be able to smash Grease. Yeah, he denounced us. So if I waited with the embassy... I wouldn't be able to get it. But actually, did I lose it with the renunciation? Okay, let's go, let's send more and more ships north to fight Shaka. Uh, City Assault is nice on that mechanized infantry. Can we take the city now? Let's step back. One, two, three, four. I'll try to play a little bit faster now when the most complicated war is over. Three. Uh, I need more room. This should be enough. We'll move forward. And this might actually be enough. Okay, excellent. So this isn't in the best shape. It's actually in a pretty bad shape, but I'll still take it. Monopoly on porcelain. What the hell is monopoly on porcelain? Um. That's like a fifth Golden Age Monopoly that uh, we got. Okay, more upgrades. Why are we starving? Oh, 
But I also really want to work the uranium. Uh, scientists. For now, that will have to do. Or actually, can I do it this way? I don't think we're gonna lose population. Okay, this will do. You need aluminum. Let's see what we can do about that. Marble from Theodora. Can we buy aluminum from our vassals, by the way? No. How much do you want for dice? Oh, come on. Why do I even bother? Okay, research. Hmm. I don't really care about stealth. Don't really care about lasers because uh, I hope nukes will be banned long before anybody can get nuclear missiles. I could try Apollo program now when uh, when William doesn't have doesn't have his capital, he shouldn't be able to get uh, the satellites that fast. So I think that's what we're gonna do. After that. Telecommunications and then robotics. We'll see if we get some uh, death robots. So there is Hubble. We are only one tech behind. Okay, that's not too bad. So many things that we need to fix. Holy crap. I am probably gonna buy some more workers. <clears throat> uh, where did you come from? Arsenal, here we do. The city now has strength 83. There is no way he takes it with iron clouds. Um, I could build a military base as well if I really wanted to be safe, but I think we are fine. Let's build the academy and the courthouse here. Okay, how does it look like on this side? Whoa. I think Theodora may need some help with this. Let's try to take out this iron clad as well. I'll ignore the destroyer.
Let's pull back. I think I'm gonna destroy this tank. Unfortunately, I can't use this bazooka for anything. Um, oh, come on. One, two, three, four. That's fine. I was hoping I'd be able to kill both. I guess not. Okay, so this side is done more or less. Um, thinking if I need all of my artillery here, because I don't think so. 67 is the strongest city, 65, 60, and we will have three artillery with extra range that are coming and then three more that have range three that has to be enough i'm gonna send where are they i'm gonna send these to start working on a shaka uh if we let's see we can shoot from here. So if we hold this line, then we can start hitting Yerevan. It's gonna take forever with only three, but um, we can start working on it. Okay, for now, uh, let's just get them closer. One, two, three. Um, Why do we have 20,000? I'm thinking if I can afford it to pay for this arsenal. But I, actually, 42. Eh, let's do it. And wait, we can get these upgrades. Boom. I don't remember last time I got uh, modern armor and. Uh, well, I wanted to say I wanted to say the game wasn't decided yet. The game more or less is decided, but there still are some interesting wars. So they will get their share of proper fighting. Which I'm looking forward to that. Um, oh, we will also get rocket artillery. That's also something I didn't get in ages. Maybe I should save the money for the rocket artillery before I buy upgrades that are not necessary. <clears throat> I 
Okay. Oh, still have to give more orders. How far can I go? Be done. I think everything should be much smoother in the next episode. It's just that these few turns and I have to move all the units and figure out what I'm trying to do and where. Take some time. <clears throat> That's a lot of ships. I think Shaka is gonna take Monaco. How fast is modern armor? 5. So the same speed as normal tanks. Uh, I'll just go for the kill. I think the upgrade is more important. Oh, there's another tank. Can we move all the way here? Well, let's try.
By the way, can we get recycling centers? Don't think so. Recycling centers are here. Um, there would be two tags delay. That's not worth it. Really want to try steal that scientist from William. One more thing. How much fate do we have? 22. Uh, this is probably not gonna happen, but just in case. How close are we to a natural general? Should it take that long with all the wars that we are fighting? I saw the wrong unit. I wanted to sell the worker. I'm an idiot and that was pretty experienced uh, infantry. Crap. I was already thinking about something else. I was thinking about these workers that I shouldn't uh, forget to buy them. Uh, well, made a mistake. Three. I can just wait. How is that possible? Oh, it's a hill and jungle. That's how it's possible. Never mind. I thought I would have enough movement to move, to get back, and then I realize it's three action points. It's fine. You can just do this for one turn and I'll gladly get one more kill There's one more somewhere. I don't see it right now, so hopefully. Oh, it's here. Why is it not moving? Come on. There it is. Next.
this is the iron clod I was looking for. Let's get rid of the other iron clod as well. Nice. Yeah, I think I'm not gonna uh, lock everything manually anymore. Now it's just about getting the cities that we need as quickly as possible. Good. I really want to finish these tiles. They might be still still relevant for defense in like fifteen turns. Range, nice. Okay, now when the ships are gone, more or less, you'll start focusing on all the units. leave I'm not sure if this tile has fallout let's check that out I don't think so uh, let's just pillage this one this one has fallout I think if I should just leave it if uh, William attacks that it would be a problem for him standing there ah let's just get rid of all of it Okay, next. Um, 
can shoot once more. One, two, three, four. Let's hit the tank again. Okay, what are our options? Gold, cost for purchasing buildings, don't really care, attack bonus and experience in friendly territory. Uh, don't think we'll be inside friendly territory that much. On the other hand, well, we could take, let me check the happiness. We do have some poverty, we could take peaceland bread. Twenty percent building maintenance. Well, who cares with the money that we have? Attack Christian experience for military units in friendly territory. Okay, let's take guerrilla warfare because that will give us a general faster. Definitely want to build strategic defenses again uh, around William. So let's start working on that. There still are some ships, but I don't think we have to worry about those. Now I just have to figure out how am I going to squeeze all of these units into this choke point. Uh, what we need is to hold this line. Even this would probably be enough. So I just have to kill these two. Let's get that tank out of here. You'll move back. Can I? It's a little risky. See how much damage we can do. It's not great, considering it's a rocket artillery bombarding a rifleman. I would expect a little bit more. Oh well. We managed to get through. Get the artillery on the road.
Do we still... I mean, can we kill this guy? And... Like, protect the bazooka. I think we can. This is still too expensive. Um... Come on, yeah. I said die. This should work. Fortunately, it's not gonna be a kill. Unless one, two, three, four, five. Is it gonna be a kill? Two, four. On, there has to be something somewhere. I mean, I could get it killed just by attacking with the mechanized infantry. This is what I could do, and that's pretty safe. And, uh, oh, I can't repair these gunships. I was thinking, why are they repairing? We are missing the, the aluminum. Okay, so I think we are done with this episode. As you can see, turns are getting faster and faster now. Or faster and faster. They are a little bit more organized and uh, faster than uh, when we started this episode. So next time, we will try to push Shaka back so that our uh, rocket artillery can start hitting Yerevan. I'll just have to figure out. No, actually, getting vision will be easy with uh, all the gunships. Speaking about the, the helicopter gunships, I should probably pillage this. What is it? The fourteen twenty oil. So that's on this side. On the other side. Let's actually end the turn. I want to see how many units are gonna arrive here. Some extra money from Caravans Alexander completed Manhattan Project, but it doesn't mean anything. Just getting Manhattan Project doesn't mean he can make nukes. Not sure. How many tags does he have? 59. I'm pretty sure he doesn't have the tag to uh, build nukes yet. Quite a lot of damage. 
How many tags does Shaka have? 60. So it is also far behind. Um, but look at the, look at William. Still tacking up like crazy. Okay, so uh, I wanted to check how many units. Whoa, that's a that's quite a few ships. I don't think they're gonna be a problem for Grouts or Nosos. Uh, it, it might be a problem for Sparta. Nah, it will be fine. So it just takes Sparta as quickly as possible. And uh, then we should be able to attack both Corinth and Athens at the same time, I think. But well, we are done with this episode, so I hope that you liked it. I hope that you're going to join me next time again. And until then, have a good time. Bye-bye.